What's up guys? Welcome back to the review space and today we take a look at the Australia's Daryl Lee soft eating licorice strawberry flavor. My god! Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go have a taste of this. Actually, let's look at the uh, packaging first. It's got this nice little brown beige-ish beige -ish color with some red. And obviously right there, Australia Daryl Lee since 1927 i've never heard of this never seen it this is a very first time for me supposedly low in fat it's licorice natural flavor made in australia the land down under uh, but uh, the picture of the licorice actually looks more like a sausage as opposed to an actual tasty candy back side it's got uh, 130 calories per three pieces uh, 1 gram, 2%, saturated 0 0.5, no cholesterol, uh, and no vitamins or nothing. Made out of raw sugar, glucose syrup, wheat flour, cane sugar water, or cane sugar, and then water, modified corn allergies, contains wheat, sulfites, may contain traces of peanuts and tree nuts. Australian made, Daryl Lee Chocolate Shops, um, uh, they have a website, dlea.com.au. Vegetarian society approved. So to all you veg heads out there, I guess it's fine. Oh my god, look at the best before. It expires on February 16, 2013, all the way to next year. I am covered, son. Get ya. I finally did it. After years of searching for the finest ingredients, I have found a perfect combination of satisfying mouth-watering flavor and soft texture. I have created the world's first soft-eating licorice. There's nothing as guilt-free, enjoyable, and Australian as Daryl Lee soft eating licorice. Store in a cool, dry place. Reseal bag to maintain freshness after opening. All right, enough talking. I'm gonna eat some 200 grams of licorice. Here we go. Oh yeah. Ooh, it has a very nice smell. It's very candy smelling. Ooh. It's a very familiar smell. What if I smelled that before? All right, here we go. Mm. Ooh, it's really soft. Ah, kind of chewy. And I don't mean Chewbacca from Star Wars. I mean chewable. As in licorice. Yes. It's kind of gummy. You know, like a chewy. Soft uh, uh, gummy beer. Oh. It's actually got a nice uh, texture to it. It is quite soft, but it doesn't have like that stretchy kind of thing. When you bite into it, it easily breaks off. It's pretty good. Oh, not too bad. I don't know how much is inside per bag, but it's supposed to be 200 grams. Hmm. Each of the licorice is about maybe two and a half uh, inches, and maybe about I don't know a quarter, not even a quarter, but maybe half an inch uh, in thickness. They're definitely bite size. The taste is not too shabby. They do stick in your gums a little bit. In the mouth. But I like that it's very, very chewable. It doesn't stick. It's not like kind of like that hard. Um, what's the word for it? Like it's, it's um, some licorice is just way too... Uh, Kind of tough, you know, it's got a toughness to it. Almost like beef jerky. I don't know, I mean, the taste itself isn't that amazing. It's not like this crazy, impressive, overwhelmingly amazing sweet candy, but it's still pretty good. You probably need something to uh, wash it down, though, because they do get, they get stuck to, the, to your teeth. I mean, there's no doubt about it. Alright, so that's it for this review. The soft-eating licorice strawberry flavor 
from Daryl Lee. It's from Australia. Never had it. Don't know if I'll ever have it again, but it was pretty good. Not too bad. Probably one of the better uh, licorice I've ever tasted. So, I suggest if you can find it. Uh, you're gonna give it a thumbs up. Stay tuned. Check out the rest of the channel. And until next time. Ciao.